Hello all. In this video, we are going to discuss about the synthesis of fentanyl citrate. Okay, so first, fentanyl citrate. This is the structure of fentanyl and this is the structure of citrate. So see, observe here, the N which is attached to the brain gene is known as the aniline and this N which is attached to the piperidine, so this is known as the N4 piperidinyl. Okay, and here see, Fentanyl is an analgesic and which is a narcotic analgesic and fentanyl is used along with other CNS depressant. So mostly fentanyl is used to treat the severe to moderate brains. Okay and here see this is the IUPAC name of fentanyl. So that is N-1-phenyl-ethyl-4-piperindinyl propion anilide citrate. So now we are going to discuss about the synthesis. So see, first of all, the propionyl chloride, which is known as the 1, 2, 3, pro, this is ketone, the propionyl chloride, which is attached to the chloride. So it's going to react with the N4 piperindyl aniline, aniline. So see, this is the aniline. Okay, so this aniline, where it contains the N, which is attached to the piperidine group here, by this is known named as an N. This here see the numbering 1, 2, 3, 4. So that's why it is named as N terminal N4 piperidinyl and this is aniline. So okay, N4 piperidin aniline. So here due to condensation, see here the H which is going to remove along with chlorine as HCl. Okay, now we are getting this see how it is attached means when the H is going to remove along with the chloride the leftover product is going to attach to this N and because of this lack of H we are getting the stability of the nitrogen and see here after on this is the first step so later on continuation the second step is this so when this product is going, when this intermediate is going to react with the C6HY, CH2, CH2, CL and citrate, it's going to form our original product that is the fentanyl citrate. See how here it is attached means, see the same structure came along with the forward step and see here N and here this N, this piperidine N losses the H and instead of this we are getting this ethyl group and as and this phenyl group here and the left over CH2 CH2 here and this N again going to remove as HCl by combining with the chlorine and it eliminates as HCl and the citrate is combining with this fentanyl and now it's forming the fentanyl citrate. I hope you would like the video and please make sure to like and subscribe and comment.